Hi everyone, Miss Sarah back with some more nature crafts and it's getting close to summer which means all the leaves have fully developed on the trees so we're gonna do some leaf prints. Here are some leaf print examples and you can see some I even cut out from the paper after the print was dry but what we'll need is some paper and some leaves and then some paint and something to oh there's my cat something to <laughs> Melvin and something to get messy on so I have an old cereal box but you can use newspaper because you are going to get a little bit messy with the paint before printing okay to start out you're going to take your leaf um, and just oh, with help from a cat the process of leaf printing is pretty simple so you're going to take your leaf and you're going to paint both sides of it and this is why you want something uh, underneath like newspaper or cardboard to get messy because you're going to paint out on the sides of the leaf so you can see I'm getting a lot of paint all around and then we're going to flip the leaf and do the other side as well and I think you can also learn some things as you do nature crafts so maybe you want to try and find out what type of tree or plant your leaves came from so maybe you want to use a field guide or you can use iNaturalist. That's an app for your phone so you can just snap a picture and it'll give you suggestions of what species of tree or plant your leaf is from. So we're going to take this maple leaf now that it's painted on both sides and now we're going to get our paper ready and you want two pieces of paper. So here's the bottom sheet and I'm going to put the leaf wherever you want it and then you can take a top sheet and you're gonna sandwich that leaf in between. And this is when you really wanna press down all around the leaf to get a good print. So you can feel where the leaf is and make sure that you've pressed down all around. Okay, and then you're gonna lift your paper up. There's one print, our leaf stuck to this side, but we can get two prints. And they look a little different, look at that. So that is one leaf print. And you can do multiple leaves on each page. Um, you could also cut the leaf out once you're done, once you let it dry, it's up to you. You can also do a fold over technique. So here I've painted both sides of this fern and I'm gonna fold the paper over. This is great to make cards or any decorative paper. And when we open it up, you're gonna have a double print. Just like that. I hope you have fun making your leaf prints and happy nature crafting.